Hello, Corret, Slime Trailer Tamer. Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green. Uh, that was rather good if I didn't see some myself. Last time, we started the game and I got our starter Pokemon, but it is a Squirtle. And in this episode, we're going to be exploring through Route 1 again on our way back to Viridian City. And here's going to be our potential first victim of Pokemon to be caught. Like I said, I'll, I'm quite sure I said it. This, this is going to be a catch em all run, unless I said that in one of my fail tapes. I'm going to be catching all the Pokemon that are possible for me to catch without hacking. So there's basically only one Pokemon that I can get, and I just killed this Pidgey, so I can't catch this Pidgey. But at least I'm gaining some experience. So I guess I'll. S uh, I don't know. Let's see what this is. Wow! First Rattata? Like, I. I ran into a couple wild Pokemon on my second take, and I didn't run into any Rattata. This is my first Rattata. So I guess that's cool. And I probably shouldn't have done the second one. Okay, he's just enough. Then he probably has like 1 HP left, so. Perfect time to be using our Pokeball. Just so you guys know, no button combination works. All I need to do with catch Pokemon is weaken it as much as possible. There will be better balls later on in the game, but anyway, we caught Rattata. It bites anything when it attacks, small and very quick, as it is a common sight in many places. Uh, Rattata will not be a permanent team member, so I will not give it a nickname. But my first one, I named it Cinnamon after a after the rat in the book called Star Girl because we were reading it at the time. Weird as that may sound. Um, I'm actually gonna go catch a Pidgey now. And hello, Mr. Pidgey. You are level 2, and you are a dude. In my first run, I caught a Pidgey named Ace. And this Pidgey seems to have a good deal of defense, which probably wouldn't be the best Pidgey because Pidgeys are more speed based and attack based, and why not kill that? Uh, I guess we'll see when I run into another PG and that to level 7, yay! Alright. And I learned Bubble Attack, which is gonna be Butta's first water attack. Uh, let me go ahead and go over Bubble real quick. Quick, quick, kick, punch. Okay, it, do it only has 20 power, 100% accuracy, spray bubbles its foe. You may lower the foe's speed stats to make up for, for how slow Squirtles and its uh, family can be. Pokemon Evolve, if you didn't already vote, know that, uh, we'll be getting into that later on. And let's see if I can get this Fiji. Also, uh, Squirtle, every Pokemon has an ability. Squirtle's specific ability is Torrent, which will, when it has about a third of its HP left, uh, its ability Torrent will kick in, which does rough, roughly 1.5 times as much damage, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, uh, Okay, you fainted. Okay, at least I have this Rattata. Let's just let's just hope that nothing weird happens. It may have a 255 out of 255 rate of catching, which that doesn't mean that you can catch him out of while on full health though, but I'm quite sure I'm gonna be catching it here though. Indeed I do. So let's hope I don't run into bad luck. Well this Pidgey, I have two Pokemon and support myself until I get to the Pokemon Center to heal myself. So, yep, okay. <laughs> If I were to run into that a Pokemon in that one patch of grass, that would have been crazy. And also, guys, there's uh, something I forgot to show off last time because I was kind of in a rush. Uh, I will put it right now. Funny, isn't it? So right now, welcome to our Pokemon Center, would you like me to tell you Pokemon about appropriate health? Yes, indeed, Lee Doodle. And just like that, your Pokemon are restored to full health. Now if only real life was like that. Alright. Hmm. I'm trying to think here. Uh I could go out right here, but there's actually something. That's rather difficult to do right now, so I will come back to it later on. Uh, and over here, here's a hidden Pokeball item, which is a potion. You had another free potion. And also something I di didn't show off was the Pokemon Trainer School. So you're ready for a speed up. This is not the Pokemon Trainer School. 
Yes, your daddy does love Pokemon too. Yeah, clever nicknames. Blah, Spiri. Hmm, what is that red blush you have? Okay, I'm not going to train still quite yet because I ran into this guy because he stops you along the way when you catch the Pokemon. Blah, 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 blah. So I'm not going to catch the Pokemon. I suppose I better show you then. So there's no way you can say no to this. You have to see the tutorial to catching Pokemon. So just sit back and watch what he does. <laughs> if this were actually the uh, Pokemon Yellow, he'd fail. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure he only fails in Yellow because like the Yellow is like a special game ish. Well, with all the, well, with the Pikachu and stuff, and probably adds a twist to him succeeding like this. And there's a car outside. So that's pretty much the gist of high catch Pokemon. Of course, you have to weaken them. Yeah. And here, take the suit, the TGTV, the item that nobody uses in their LPs. And I'm actually going to show it off for myself. Uh, can you go back, please? Tell them to set the decision. Novice. Teach me how to battle. Uh, I'll just, I'll just show this off. And this weird dude comes around. Hey, yelly trainers out there! Hello, trainers! Blah, 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 blah. Come on, let me hear you. Hello, trainers! It's me, the Poke Dude. The day the Poke Dude's here to tell you how about I can battle Pokemon. Say your route first roll when suddenly wild Pokemon appears. It's up to you to smartly use your Pokemon, use your moves to reduce the opponent's HP to nothing, and claim victory. I'll say I'd do that in person for sure. Alright, here goes. Keep your eyes glued to the Super Poke Dude Show. Oh, yeah. And he runs into a PG. Wait, this might. I think this might. I don't know. This might actually be the old dude. Because he seems like he's coming sort of old age, and that's kind of high levels. A Pidgey should have evolved by now. Uh, we'll see what Pidgey's evolution is later on in the game. And... Yeah. Pretty basic stuff. Nothing much to it, really. It's just whoever dies first... loses. <laughs> if we can already tell from the start of the game, or knowing that this is simply an RPG, that's how RPGs work. How did you get that? Even if you're no, 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 not to worry. Unable to battle. I'm pretty sure I heard that line at least about 500 times during the Pokemon anime. So that's pretty much the TV, Tichi TV for you. And stupid me, the train of schools right here. All right. No, 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 no. Speeding up, speeding up, speeding up. Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 Hey, don't look at my notes! Okay, be sure to read what's on the blackboard carefully. Alright, status problems. Sleep! Blah! Blah! Poison! Blah! Paralysis! Blobity! Burning! Blah bloozle! Freezing! Herp, herp. And exit. It does nothing. Well, then again, exit is like the most powerful paralysis. I mean, status problem in the game. My Radita is a female, I just noticed that. Uh, I don't really need anything from the Pokemon right now. Even though I could use some antidotes because, well, if you couldn't already guess by now, we're about to be going into stuff that involves poison. Uh, which, uh, there's actually some free antidotes anyway that we'll be able to find in the place. She goes shopping in Pewter City, occasionally. So, yes. Trigger tips, catch one in your collection. The more you have, the easier it is to battle. Alright, let's get going on to Route 2. It's leading from Verdian City to Pewter City, even though that there's a Verdian Forest coming up soon, if you couldn't already tell. Uh... I do not wish to do Pokemon Biles, but... Bios, if you couldn't already tell. Uh, yeah. Yes, I did catch a rat my good dear. Carefully, don't get lost. Welcome to the Viridian Forest. The first dungeon is sharing the game. Go up to the tree, and we find an antidote. I came with some friends to do some bug catching stuff. There's some good Pokemon battles. 
Alright, you can fight trainers in this game. You couldn't already tell you have to fight under other trainers, but the thing is for me, I'm actually not going to Okay, here's a Caterpie. I'm actually not going to show off regular trainer battles, even though that doesn't really seem like something I do to be cutting out like every single trainer battle. Like I'll only keep it in if something funny slash interesting or important happens, like Pokemon gains level and learns uh new move or something of the sort and critical hit. Uh, okay, let's see what else I can run into. And here's a Weedle, pretty much the counterpart to Caterpie. And the thing about Weedle is that it can poison you. Like it, good thing did not do to Buddy. But it might do here. And it still doesn't. It seems like it, well, then again, it's a little slow, but. Anyway, I'm just gonna try to catch it. It's about to think that the Weedle's fast, but. Eh, that's no matter. I caught it. And the leader be. Alright. So many informations. Blah blah, that makes perfect sense. Of course, it is important if you're new to Pokemon. And I just ran into a Pokemon, and it's just another Weedle, and so I'm just gonna run away from it. Alright, right here we have a potion. I could actually get the Pokemon Spiro right now, and also Mankey, but I'll be going that for the, in the next episode. I would be like a uh, training up my Pokemon a little bit off screen, actually. Um, but I'm still gonna be fighting all these trainers. Hey, yeah, Pokemon, come on, let's battle him! No, Caterpie can't hack it. Derp. All right, uh, how much damage do I take from that battle? Yeah. That battle was kind of troublesome because I don't really have a lot of stuff. And here we have another random battle, but just for the sake of Pokemon, of their weird stuff, they say, Yo, you can't jump out if you're a Pokemon trainer. And we beat Doug. Well, I ran out of the Pokemon. And here in plain sight is an antidote. Which is very interesting, like cool and stuff. Uh, here we could cut straight across, but why? Well, I don't really want to do the battle. Ah, I'm just gonna do it for, for the sake of showing off what they say. Hey, look at my way, sir. I might be a little bit a little lucky to go and easy on me. Level ten, very nice. And we learn withdrawal, which basically raise my defense. We defeated Anthony. Oh, boom! Nothing went right. Uh, the only Pokemon I have left is Buddy, so I think I'm actually going to go heal at the Pokemon Center, so BRB. Mm. Right over this way is the battle. Which, uh, actually, Weedle evolves into Cocoon at level 7, so that was a Haxor Cocoon or something. Alright. We're progressing on our way and stuff. And right here is yet another trainer. Of course, optional. Did you do the Pokemon Evolve? Yes, I did. And finally, I got finally Poison. Poison something for once. Ooh, Shed Skin, eh? And finally beat Bowcatcher Charlie. Oh, I lost! Uh, that's like, uh, that's so bad. Alright, let's see if I can get through this. Oh, wait, there's still one more trainer battle, and I just pushed in my control stick. Alright, down here is a Pokeball that contains a potion, which will definitely be useful. Blah, 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 blah. Extreme common sense. Why me? Hey, 
good way to put the hurry by the rush. And yeah, but it's poison. Bug catcher Sammy. Yeah, good. I'll give you what. I don't get what that in. Oh, that annoying thing. All right, we are at the end of Viridian Force. And so, guys, in the next episode, I will do the optional thing that I promised uh, way back in route. Uh, uh, I don't know what route it was, but. Uh, not like that's any matter, I'll be doing it in the next episode, so, like I said, in this episode of Pokemon Leaf Green, I will be doing the optional thing, and then moving on to Pier City and talking to all these people, because I'm video game OCD like that, so see you guys in the next episode.